understanding movement and kinesiology can be tough without visualization. Anatomage bodies, built from real human data, provide accurate visualization and motion, aiding in comprehensive kinesiology learning. With the help of anatomage bodies, let's take a closer look at how some parts of our body move. Shoulder abduction is the lateral movement of the upper limb away from the midline. Shoulder adduction is the medial movement of the upper limb toward the midline. Shoulder elevation is the upward movement of the shoulder toward the ears. Shoulder depression is the downward movement of the shoulders away from the ears. Femoral on pelvic abduction is the lateral movement of the thigh away from the midline, with the pelvis held in a fixed position. Femoral on pelvic adduction is the medial movement of the thigh towards the midline, with the pelvis held in a fixed position. Femoral on pelvic flexion is the anterior movement of the thigh away from the body, with the pelvis held in a fixed position. Femoral on pelvic extension is the posterior movement of the thigh toward the body, with the pelvis held in a fixed position. Knee flexion is the bending of the knee, decreasing the angle between the thigh and leg. Knee internal rotation is the medial movement of the tibia toward the midline. Knee external rotation is the lateral movement of the tibia away from the midline. Knee extension is the straightening of the knee, increasing the angle between the thigh and leg. Anatomage bodies enhance learning by merging real human anatomy with authentic physiological functions. This simulation fosters a deeper comprehension of physiology, offering students a practical and engaging educational experience. For more information about the Anatomage bodies, which can be found on the Anatomage table, please contact us at info at